on my phone, sorry, but this is how I typically put my chickens and ducks to bed when I want to get them in before dark and they're still out of the pen. Come along to my mongrel area. Where I've, yeah, I've got some veggies that are growing here. I can pull some veggies out of that patch that's gone to seed or I can look for my strays and usually I've got a mustard or an endive or something that's growing. Pull out a few of these varieties which of course we could eat too but we've got plenty of them. The chickens and ducks love to munch on these things. You can see them growing here, overgrowing. I pull them out whole like that. Underneath these banana trees. And we'll go down there where they'll be waiting. If I've got kitchen scraps, I'll usually bring them down too, but uh, I don't have any kitchen scraps. So I just get this stuff. Plenty of free feed because I leave our plants go to seed, a lot of them. And uh, that's what you get when you leave your veggies go to seed. You can get some strays coming up, and I just love that. And so do the birds. Come on. Hurry up, fatty. So the ducks always go in first, usually. Out a little. Oh, they'll all get a feed eventually. Once the, the chickens have finished, the ducks will come in. And I'm still having trouble getting these, one of these new ones. This chicken here, I don't know what's wrong with her, but she's, well, she's only about, you know, she's a pullet. Hasn't probably started laying yet, but uh, I guess we've, I've had them for now six weeks and she still doesn't go in. So I have to, the other three do. So I've got four, I've got two leghorns and two Loman Browns. And uh, they're going back in the pen fine. You know, they were doing that after about three weeks. But that one must be the dumbest leghorn chicken ever. She keeps uh, missing the entry and coming around the side here. So I have to keep walking around the whole pen and she'll see me coming and then she'll run back. Oh, oh gosh, she's coming up towards me, idiot. And now she'll go in. I mean, you know, sometimes it uh, dazzles me how stupid some chickens can be when the majority of them are really smart. And basically, that's how I get them into the pen for the night time. So, no night. Bye.